Time now for Eye on Retirement. Today's retirements just don't look the same as they did for our parents and grandparents. Matt Landon is the CEO of Semax Financial Group. Matt, tell us what is so different for the next generation of retirees? Oh, there's a whole host of things. For one thing, you've got pensions are not nearly as common as they used to be. You've got a larger emergence of 401ks, and that forces people to be responsible for their own retirement decisions. How aggressive do you want to be? How conservative do you want to be? How much can I pull out of this account? There's a lot of thought and decisions that go into that, and what happens is, you spend your whole career becoming really good at what you do, and then you're expected to be your own financial advisor on top of it. Well, that's where sitting down with a certified financial professional and a team of folks who understand taxes, that understand uh, different investments and can pull all of this together to create a comprehensive plan that's going to work for you. The other thing is there's so many more investment options and ways to do it, and, and there's all of this technical jargon. and. The internet does some wonderful things, but you go online and you search and you get thousands of search results in a fraction of a second. Well, which one is the one I should take? I read one article that says one thing, another article says the exact opposite. What do I do? That's where you want to sit down and have that customized plan. Now, I do think a good place to start is with our retirement toolkit. It can, it can give you some guidance and kind of send you the right direction. You can start with reading Jay's book, and, and it's completely appropriate. He titled it, America, It's Time to Rethink Your Retirement. But there's other resources in there as well. All right, great information as always. Thank you so much, Matt, always a pleasure. Call, click, or text now to get Matt's complete retirement toolkit. The team will send that right out to you. And that's this week's Eye on Retirement.